Hello guys, welcome to the next video on Linux command line tutorial for beginners. And in this video, we will see how we can use ifconfig command in Linux. So first of all, what is ifconfig command? ifconfig stands for interface configuration and it is used to view and change the configuration of network interface on your system. So to use ifconfig, you just need to write ifconfig here and that's it. And then when you press enter here, it's going to show you some output. Now, this first option here suggests that I am connected to a wired, you know, cable, Ethernet cable. So you can see when I go here on my Ubuntu operating system, it says wired connected, right? So if you see here ETH0, then it's wired connected, right? If you see here, uh, for example, WLAN 0, then you are wireless connected, right? So there can be two options here, ETS 0 or WLAN 0. And that means uh, if you are uh, connected through wire, then you will see ETH 0. And then uh, if you see WLAN 0, then you are connected to the wireless uh, connection right now eth0 is the first ethernet interface additional uh, ethernet interfaces would be named as uh, eth1 or eth2 so there can be multiple uh, you know ethernet interfaces uh, depending upon the machine you are using for example if you uh, have the machine which have multiple ethernet interfaces it's going to show you uh, ETH1 here with ETH0 and ETH2 depending upon the, you know, Ethernet interfaces on your Linux operating system. But by default, uh, ETH0 ETH will be your main Ethernet interface, right? Now, what is this L0 or LO? This LO is a loop back interface. And this is a special network interface that the system uses to communicate with itself. So for now, we uh, are not really much concerned about uh, this output. But uh, just remember that this is for the wired connection, right? Now in here, you will uh, see some outputs. So you can see the link here is the Ethernet. Now second is the hardware address and this is the mac address of your um, computer then here you will see the local ip address of your uh, computer and then you have the broadcast uh, ip address which is same as the great gateway address i think and there is the mask ip address also okay so this is the MAC address, which you cannot change. And every, uh, I think, machine have unique MAC address, ideally. And this is the LAN address, so local area network address. It's not the uh, W uh, WAN address. It's a local area, uh, you know, network address, right? Now, this, which you are seeing here, is the IPv6 address. Now there are two kind of, uh, you know, IP addresses, IPv4, which is your, a standard and widely used uh, address, which is this kind of uh, address and IPv6, which is also a standard and uh, it's gaining popularity. But uh, till now, this IPv4 is more popular than IPv6, right? So this is your IPv6 address. Now, uh, you can see uh, the Rx packet and Tx packet. These are uh, the received packet and transmitted packet at the time of uh, the execution of uh, this command, right? And zero error and, uh, you know, zero drop overruns is zero. So that means your internet is working properly, right? Now, if you have multiple uh, Ethernet interfaces or WLAN interfaces, then, uh, for example, you want to see only one uh, uh, interface, you can uh, do something like this for that. So, ifconfig and then the name of the interface. For example, if you want to see the 
ETH0 interface. It can be ETH1 also if you have two uh, Ethernet interfaces. And it can be ETH2 also if you have uh, three Ethernet interfaces, right? So for now, we only have one Ethernet interface, which is ETH0. So just give IPF config and then the name of your interface. And it's just going to show you the information about that interface and no extra information will be shown like this loopback information will not be shown to you. Okay. So give the name of the interface before this IF config and it's going to show you the you know information about that interface. Now uh, there are two uh, other command I want to talk about here is uh, the up command command and the down command okay so let me clear the terminal now when you use for example i have eth0 interface right so when i write if uh, config here and then eth0 and with that if i use uh, up command or down command then it's going to enable or disable my internet connection right so for example right now i'm connected to internet i can see that uh, the wired connection is there right and i want to uh, you know disable my internet connection so i can just write the if config command and the name of the interface i know that uh, my interface name is eth0 which we have seen from uh, this command and then uh, you can use down command with that and now i'm going to press enter here and it says uh, the permission denied so you need to use this uh, command with sudo which is going to uh, give you the super user privileges so just use sudo if config your interface name and down and then press enter and give your password and if, as soon as you do this your internet connection will be down okay so you can see, I can see this uh, message now disconnected. You are not offline, right? Now to make my internet connection uh, once again up, I can just use instead of down, I can use up command with this and then press enter. And then once again, I'm going to give my password here and then press enter. And then this is going to, uh, you know, once again reconnect to my network you can see connected right so these are the two important flags or these are the two important commands you can use with uh, this if config command but there are many flags and uh, many commands you can use with uh, this um, if config so just do man and if config and see what are the options available and just play uh, with these command there are so many command which i cannot cover in one video but i just wanted to give you this information that this command exists and how to use it basically okay so i hope you've enjoyed this video please recommend subscribe and bye for now